Now to our coronavirus coverage. Hospitals in California across the country are receiving their first shipments of a second coronavirus vaccine. So far, the state's received 110,000 doses of the Moderna vaccine. 672,000 doses are expected by the end of the week. KPI x Katie Nielsen live in Dublin to explain how it's going to speed up the fight against the virus. Katie? Here at Alameda County Fire Station 17, all of the firefighters working today have already been vaccinated. They got the Pfizer vaccine last week. Now with the Moderna vaccine coming to the Bay Area, it means even more people will be able to get the shot. These boxes are full of vials of the Moderna vaccine. More than 6 million doses started shipping across the country yesterday. And this afternoon, the governor announced in a press conference 31 sites across the state started getting their allotment today. The Moderna vaccine has arrived, uh, and that is indeed good news. 672,600 to be exact is what we anticipate receiving this week. According to county health departments, Contra Costa County got 13,800 doses of the Moderna vaccine this morning. San Francisco is expecting 6,000 doses and Napa County already received 1,700. It gives us hope and hope is something we haven't had for a long time. UC Berkeley public health expert Dr. John Schwartzberg says having more of the vaccine available throughout the Bay Area means the rollout can happen beyond health care workers in high risk settings. Because the sooner that group gets vaccinated, then you can move into phase 1B. The sooner you get phase 1B, then you can get to phase 1C. The state committee working on how to roll out the vaccine will meet again on Wednesday to talk about which group should be prioritized. While yesterday, the CDC came up with their list of recommendations, saying the next group to get the vaccine should be people 75 and older, especially in long-term care settings, as well as essential workers, including teachers, first responders, and grocery store workers. And Katie, what did the governor say about Moderna's vaccine getting out into the rural areas? So the hope now is that this will actually allow for that rollout. The problem with the Pfizer vaccine going to the rural areas is it has to be kept at 94 degrees below zero. That's something only specialized freezers can do. Those are usually only found at the major medical centers. The Moderna vaccine only has to be kept at about negative five. That's something a regular freezer can do. So that allows for the Moderna vaccine to finally be shipped out to some of these smaller rural communities. Entirely different. All right, Katie Nielsen, thanks so much.